Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be showing you how to build a D flip flop. And now for anyone who doesn't know what D flip flop is, it is a redstone machine that turns a button, a little pulse of a button, into a lever. So, to make this, all you need is a button, r redstone, redstone torches, pist normal pistons, blocks of redstone, and any block you want. I prefer blocks of diamond since they're my favorite. Now, all you need to do is put one piston on the floor, leave two spaces, put another piston. So they look like this. So now, after you did that, you need to um, get so the, the block of your choice and then make a little bridge sort of thing over them. And now you can walk over them. Yay! Anyways, getting back to the situation. Um, you put uh, like you put two redstone over those. Put a button. And now if you do that, nothing will happen. But then, after you do that, put a redstone block. And this works only for 1.5 or 1.5.1 or any other version higher than that. So, anyways, after you get this block of redstone, get your redstone torches. Put one over the on the block over the piston that had already the redstone block, and then put another redstone torch on the other block. And now you notice it's supposed to move, but it didn't move because there's a block facing it, and that will block the current. So, but if you do it the other way, like this same thing will happen and then you'll notice that after you press the button th this block will move and it will be like straight on the timer but now here's the fun part For where the button is facing choose there are two blocks here choose any one of them that you want I always choose right because I always make my prints go right then you go to the other side and since it's the opposite way th the right this way is on is on this side but the right this way is on this side so you put the, this side over like this you can see now that this redstone current is already charged but this one has no charge so after you press the button the redstone block will move making this one move and, and by the way for any of you who don't know redstone blocks can activate redstone so maybe just a new boat won't, won't know that but yeah it can and here's the proof if you put a redstone torch they'll block off the charge because uh, redstone torches only go off when you charge them with the redstone that's not indirect that I mean that's not direct so if I put a button over here and do this this block will obviously do this but if I make it like direct contact like this for example that would be like the stupidest IED which ever existed but all you do is to strengthen the charge over here which won't do any basically anything see won't do anything just makes it a bit more higher that's it so getting back to our situation if you want to make for example a piston door I'll show you how to do that after I pause the video and come back doing that. Okay, I'm back and I found a way to do this. So, here's our old flip flop, T flip flop. It's still working well. I've gotten too rotten. Anyways, here's the piston door. 
As you can see, there's nothing you can see except it says like blue over there. You can see that I have some pistons over here, which I forgot to hide. Sorry for that. Anyways, after I press the button, what I can actually do is activate the flip flop and then this will turn off turning everything off and just to show you I can do something much complicated over here but since the current is coming from over here to there I can't make the pieces the other way otherwise it won't work like here's an example It won't work. I need to make it the way I'm facing it. And then we'll close the piston door. Now it's turned on, which turns the pistons on, which pushes apart the blocks, timed blocks. Push them together, I mean. So when you press the button, you've got your little place or your little piston door. Yep. And I think that's everything we have. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And tell me if you have any other redstone ideas that I could build. Rocky White is here. Bye.